Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is Philly Sport 76 bringing you an in-person autograph recap. Uh, I did the 76ers versus the New Jersey Nets. Um, did absolutely awesome. I grabbed the Sixers. This was my last game of the season. Um, here's my binder. That's where I got all my autographs. Uh, first, I want to start. Earlier today, I got my first TTM. I just want to show that real quick again. Scott Brooks. Find 101. So that was earlier. That's my first autograph of the day. Then, let's move into the game. First of all, uh, I went and I saw this at the box office, I guess you would say. Just wanted to get that uh, SmackDown thing. And then the guy in there said that his wife works for Panini. So he gave me this pack of cards. He said it never hit the market. It hasn't hit the market yet. But it says 2011, so I don't know if he was lying or not. But uh, I really only got Randy Orton and guys like that. Just figured I'd show that. It's free anyway. Alright, so on to the autographs from the game. Uh, didn't graph the Nets, but um, the Sixers finished earlier than the Nets. And uh, my brother had a couple Popeye Jones cards, and he's pretty easy to recognize. So uh, I got him on an index card just by chance. So here's another autograph. Now this, these are the autographs that I got before, before the game. I got Aaron McKee, signed in blue. Um, I've been trying to get him all year on this card. And he's just been walking away or being interviewed or whatever. So I finally got him on the last game. There's Aaron McKee. Uh, I got two daddies youngs. And I let my brother have one. It was a uh, same card. He actually gave me the cards to sign on. So I uh, got one, two Thaddeus Youngs, but there's one. Then um, the broadcaster for the Sixers. I have a PC of him, Malik Rose. Real nice guy. Uh, played for the Spurs, Thunder, and Knicks, and uh, Charlotte Hornets. He also went to Drexel, but... Um, I have a PC of him, and I got four cards. It's kind of hard to see this one uh, on the Spurs signed in blue. Then uh, Charlotte Hornets card signed in blue. All these came out really great. Um, jersey card. Really, it, you can't see it on camera, but he signed it. His autograph fit perfectly that it wouldn't, like, go on his face. I don't know. It was kind of cool. But, uh... Jersey card autograph. And then, to me, what I consider the mojo out of those four is this, uh, his Drexel card. And I got a, a gold paint pen, and he signed it in gold, and it came out absolutely perfect. Uh, tough to see on camera, but there's no streaking, nothing. It was, act it was a great autograph, and he was a real nice guy. And actually, a funny story, when we went over there, he, um, there was other people once once we once we went over to him a lot of people tried to get autographs so he kept uh, having to use my gold sharpie but he was really nice about it and uh, he was a cool guy so I got one more thing but I'm gonna save that for last from before the game but uh, this next is gonna be a huge shout out to Roid Rage 29 um, I messaged him before the game about where the players leave uh, after the game. And he told me it was uh, by a certain spot. I'm not going to give it away. But uh, if you want to know, just PM me. Um, but absolutely awesome. And there was a ton of traffic, so the players really had no choice but to sign. Because um, the Phillies game just finished as soon as the Sixers game did. So there was a ton of traffic. Um, a couple players uh, like took a detour, like Andre Godala. But I'm not going to be upset. I got a ton of autographs after it. Uh, first, Nick Vucevic on a decoy. I didn't have any cards for him. But uh, he was a nice guy. He signed. And then uh, my favorite, my best, I'll save that for last. I got two of two from Spencer Hawes. Uh, funny story, He, the traffic seemed like it was lightening up. And he stopped signing. And then he got all the way out, and then 
traffic picked up again, so he stopped. And he was just sitting there, and no one wanted to go over. And my brother told me I should go over, because he had his window down. And uh, he signed for me these two cards. Really nice guy. I didn't expect him to be really nice, but he I heard he was like the best, nicest guy on the Sixers, and it turned out that he was. Um, here's a Craig Brackens card. I actually didn't get this one signed. My brother got this one signed. I got his rookie card signed, but... Um, I gave that one to my brother, and he gave me this card to get signed. He actually got it signed, but, uh, he gave it to me. So that's Craig Brackens. And then here's the best of the night. Elton Brand. Two of two. Signed my two best cards of him. Uh, on a Fleer in an upper deck. Came out really good on the Fleer. So, a total of 15 autographs by far the best I've ever done but here is my absolute mojo game used Thaddeus Young uh, bracelet it's really nice here and I'll show it a little bit he didn't actually wear this during the game but he always wears these uh, bracelets it's tough to see on camera but it says Thaddeus Young Dad Young 21, and you won't be able to see that. Yeah, it's not going to focus, but his uh, autograph is inscribed in that. So I traded with him. Last time I tried to get it from him, uh, he didn't just give it to me. So this time I brought another bracelet to trade with, and he did trade. So uh, really happy about that. So 15 autographs and a game used. I'm just going to show you my binder of stuff that I had. Uh, really long video, but a lot of autographs, so Iguodala didn't sign. Here's my other Elton Brands. Kind of happy he didn't sign these, uh, X Adrenalines. Had that one, and that's a kind of a cool card. It's like a see-through card. Um, Evan Turner did sign, but he was leaving, and I was the last person to try and get him, and he had to leave, so he was pulling away as I was getting up to him. So he didn't sign, Lou Williams didn't sign, at least we didn't see him sign, and uh, Jody Meeks, he just drove away, Andres Nozioni, still not on the team. Uh, Doug Collins didn't sign, I have a Doug Collins card, Maury Adala. And then Tony Batiste signed only one of one, and I gave it to my brother, because these two are mine, and the, two, the one that was there and here, but he only signed one. Which I was kind of upset about, but it is what it is. So, that is all for my Sixers binder. Oh, yeah, and Drew Holiday, he rolled down his window and uh, just gave like a peace sign and just pulled out. But I'm not upset about 15 autographs and a game used. And uh, go check out that TTM video. Thanks, YouTube.